Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and joining me here on the commentary box is Lee Dixon. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It is Standard Liège facing Brunsby. Yeah, thanks Derek. I'm so, so excited for the players. I really am. I love playing in semi-finals. Didn't play in the Champions League semi-final, mind. But you find out about yourself in a semi-final. Can you control your emotions? Can you commit to the game plan? We're just about to find out. Very, very excited. And underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. So the initial 11 for the home side. We're thinking 4-3-3. Yeah, one central striker, Derek. The width comes from the wingers who will stay high and wide. A very narrow midfield and a conventional back four. No nonsense clearance. This is how the visitors will set up today. This particular setup is becoming more and more in favour. Yes, Derek, one central striker. Two wingers will provide the width. A very narrow three in midfield. The back four, the two fullbacks will be expected to support, but also defend and help out the centre backs. Now well, they've lost it. Always difficult to predict an advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man. Lee, what are you anticipating seeing from him? Wonderfully weighted pass. Only failed to get it away properly. Just not looking confident in possession. Can't miss, surely! And the shot decidedly lacking accuracy. Well, he had other options as well, but he chose to shoot. Can he deliver accurately? couldn't make it count counter attacking very much an option and now passing it through and the task is to remain focused a 1v1 situation and the goalkeeper does his job really good experience there picked his time really good save less the end and scope for the cross well they've lost possession of the ball This looks promising. Shot attempted. Simple catch, really. Radosevic. Vilcek. Kaiser with it. And very deftly cut out. They might be able to get in now. going to be a tight game but now all of a sudden one team ahead things have got to change on both sides well when we see this again it is a wonderful effort solo effort not a question for defenders they just back off him and he takes full advantage the match has restarted one nil And that puts them in position. I'll say no shortage of space. He's got thinking time here. And putting his body on the line. Straightforward take. Real. Defense. 
danger. He's in with a chance. Well, the pass makes the goal, Derek. Good finish, yes, but the ball through is brilliant. Slide rule pass. So, a level contest. 1 1. Renault Imon. Could be a chance to break here. Good looking ball, there could be a chance now. And then with a real chance. Targets available, cross comes in. And a Judy. We've been waiting to find out, now we know. A minimum of three added minutes here. Casella Gonzalez. And Simirot on the ball. Vision, can he get to this? Can he give them the lead? And this was at home. And with that, the first half draws to a close. We certainly got to give this man high marks for his work.
Perfect pitch on a perfect day in this stadium. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. We have pre-season tournament action for you. It's a first group stage game. Two proper teams here, Alan. Yeah, hi Martin. Really looking forward to this. I mean, pre-season has changed so much over the years. You can't get fit out of the limelight in the shadows anymore. Huge events, televised matches, and uh, you've got to hit the ground running. Well, the cross doesn't get past the first man. Saw it coming, cut it out, good work. Bit of space for him, now out on the wing. Well, then they come, they're piling into the middle. Well, it was a cross that he got in quickly, but he didn't really control. Romero. Place to try and hit it now. Saved by the keeper, he can't hang on to the ball. It's there to be attacked at the back post. Put away, but not out of harm. Is on the inside. It's a very good clearance. It was needed. Jimenez. Oh, 
They couldn't keep possession. They gave it away. Romero. One or two options now in forward areas for them. Blocked off the pass there. Well read by the defender. On the move and able to cut out the pass. Well, that pass never looked like reaching its target, and they're away with the ball. Well, they're going to start from the back, because it's a back pass to the keeper. It's a challenge for the attacking team here against a mass defence. They'll have plenty of the ball, but they've got to try and break it down. It's good work here in terms of possession. Can they find the final pass? they pressed well, and now they might be in. Opportunity to cross here, and he's aimed for the far post here. In really for what seemed a certain opening goal. Oh dear, oh dear, I think it's one of those that might play on his mind now for the rest of the match. Gazinski. Jimenez. The referee has acknowledged the flag from his assistant and given the offside. Another turnover in play here with that interception. Can't get past him. Strong tackle. Jimenez. Reyes. Turnover of possession here. And it's behind for the goal kick. Oh, here comes the Mexican wave. The crowd having a good time. <laughs> Trying to get wide. And it was a good idea, but he couldn't find his supporting player. Gazinski. Well, the goalkeeper comes out there and he got to the ball. He's got strongly and got the ball. Yeah, look at that possession. It has been a cagey affair so far. Quite often in these kind of matters, it does open up as the game goes on. Will that be the case here? No doubt, this will be a throw. Gazinski. Gives it away, straight to the opposition. Referee has decided to add on two minutes. Romero. And there is the half-time whistle. Nil-nil at the break. It is level at half-time. We did think it was going to be tight, Alan. We're not always right, but this time we were. Yeah, it's not been a bad game at all, but uh, nothing to split the two sides. I just wonder what will in the end.